The Kenya Defense Forces in Somalia operating under AMISOM uh, have officially handed over the management of the port of Kismayu to the Jubaland State Administration. KDF now handles the port defense while the local administration manages imports and exports as they await a complete takeover when AMISOM winds up its mission. Hassan Mugambi reports from Kismayu. A low flight just meters above the sea. This move, forces say, is meant to avoid enemy attack in the war-torn Horn of African nation. This is Sector 6, one of the jurisdictions under AMISOM, part of which is manned by KDF troops. On the ground, an armored tank is back from an overnight operation. Despite the general calm in Kismayo, KDF troops continue with regular surveillance. Uh, we are currently mentoring the Somali National Security Forces in line with this concept of operations uh, through joint operations so that they can build their capacity. Less than a decade ago, residents of Kismayu were fully under the rule of the Al-Shabaab. The presence of the KDF here has brought some semblance of stability. According to Battalion Commander Lieutenant Colonel Mesha Kiso Yan, the operation of the port of Kismayu, once the main economic hub of the Al-Shabaab, has now been handed over to Jubaland State Administration. At the port, Manager Ahmed Aden is busy at work. He oversees the inputs and exports. He says the looming drawback of KDF forces could be detrimental to the stability of the port. We have improved the security of the port. As you can see the Navy is here, the Chupalan forces are around the, the, the port. So the security is 100% much better than it was. A few meters away, a contingent of special boat unit officers drawn from the Kenyan Navy are on high alert, conducting marine patrols. With their main undertaking being port defense, the contingent of Kenyan Navy personnel deployed here patrols the sea to ensure that the port is safe. We check the outbound and inbound vessels within that goes to Kismayu Beach and also uh, from the, uh, the deep sea. With no proper taxation or traffic laws in place, such are the vehicles that ferry imports to different destinations within Jubaland. At a distance, monitoring operation is yet another contingent with fingers on the trigger. It's not worse and it's not so good. So you can't relax and say the thing is okay. A drive through Kismayo brings to the fore a city struggling with its past, but surely determined to face the future. Popular streets and buildings coming up touted as steps to reclaim the long-lost glory of Somalia's second largest city. Hassan Mugambi, Citizen TV.